My dear students, welcome to week six, unit two. That is from 26th of November till the 30th of November. Um, in this unit, we are going to do the following. First, we're going to start this week with finishing our second draft. Uh, by the end of this lesson, you will be able to write your second draft. Uh, we are going to concentrate on Peel model, second draft, proofreading, revision, punctuation, transitions, literary devices, and creativity. You will watch a video about the key to second draft of your essay. You will have an interactive activity. You are going to watch another video about how to revise your messy first draft. You will take another interactive activity, further practice. You will evaluate your own writing. This is for the challenging question and put a mark on it. And you will have a self-assessment. Now for what to do tomorrow, I would like you to search for the main characters in Hall's novel. Now, in lesson two, you're going to read and annotate chapters from six, from six to 10. Our word wall is going to include torment, vacancy, forlorn, assure, convince, uh, preposterous, sprawl, intensity, and radiant. You'll watch a video that talks about uh, chapters six to 10 from part one of the novel. You will have an interactive activity. You'll watch another video about the summary of chapters six and seven. You will have another active activity, further practice. And for the challenging question, I will have, you will have an interactive activity that you need to solve. And for the self-assessment, of course, you will have a quiz regarding these uh, chapters. And for what to do tomorrow, you will revise everything you took through an interactive activity where you are, where you're going to be asked about everything you have took uh, before regarding Hall's uh, novel. For lesson three, we are going to continue with chapters 11 to 15. Uh, we're going to uh, concentrate on the same words. You will watch a video about it. You will have an interactivity, interactive activity about these chapters. You will have another video about Who's the boss in chapter 11? You will have another interactive activity that is um, linked to, uh, to these chapters, further practice, and another interactive activity for the challenging question, a self-assessment, and for what to do tomorrow, I would like you to answer on your notebook, what kind of a person is the warden in your opinion, and why is he that kind of a person or she? For lesson four, we're going to continue with Halls again. We're going to read and annotate chapters 16 to 20. Uh, you will watch a video about them. You will have an interactive activity. You will watch a video about the summary of chapters 16 to 18. Another interactive activity for their practice. For the challenging question, I would like you to answer, what does Stanley learn about zero? I would like you to write the answer in your notebook. There will be a self-assessment, and for what to do tomorrow, I would like you to read chapter 21 and answer the following question on your notebook. What does Stanley know about his great-grandfather's experience of being stranded in the desert? On Thursday for lesson five, you're going to recognize action and linking verbs. You're going to distinguish between action and linking verbs. Uh, for the word wall, we have action, linking, verb, subject, and predicate. You will watch a really funny uh, song about action verbs. I love uh, Jack Hartman. He's amazing uh, when talking about grammar. He's hilarious. And then you will have an interactive activity. Then we will have another tutorial video about linking verbs. And then you will have another interactive activity from your book from Savas. Further practice about action and linking verbs. You, the challenging question will be another link that you are going to solve. Uh, Self-assessment quiz. And for what to do tomorrow, I would like you to revise what you have taken that day. And I would like you to take an activity regarding uh, action and linking verbs. Um, everything you need is on the BC. I can't wait to start this uh, week. With you guys, all the love and the respect of the world, I give you warm regards.